for a while. And uh, Bobby Abrams, who was the bucking of the guitar player for 25 years, mm-hmm. they have a little acoustic duo, and it sounds funny acoustic, but, you know, with my with those two guys sing like birds. They sing so high it makes my underwear hurt. It's not cool <laughs> for them. But, you know, that mixing that with my gravelly kind of bluesy voice, I mean, we do everything from Everly Brothers to uh, T-Rex. I mean, we just do stuff. You name a song, we can do it. Mm. Uh, That'd be a great sound, I, I'm, boy. I'm famous for my very, my very weird medallies. I hear because there really are just not that many real progressions in rock and roll. They're all part of something. I, I, I can. We, we do Patty Smith into Bon Jovi. It just sounds <laughs> weird, but there <laughs> some of the songs are works. the same. I'm sure it works. Because the night belongs to lovers. Because the night to shot through the heart and you're to blame. It's just, they're the same song. They have uh, different melody. Uh, you're uh, right, we that's do, sure. We, we, we do John Fogarty, rock and roll girls, in the downtown by Lulu. <laughs> wow. <laughs> that I'm trying to think of. We now do medleys. We, we, we do two songs at the same time, two different songs at the same time. It's just the, the weird live, things I hear. You do live mashups pretty much almost. <laughs> yeah, yeah. And, um, I mean, and I don't know, uh, there's there's a that album that came out from the Little Steven tour called A Night to Remember a CD is one of the very best Shadow CDs ever. Nobody's ever going to hear it. Uh, maybe uh, if you guys, I'll send you one. But I mean, it, it was never released on any kind of a label that would do anything. I use those songs on my New Music Monday I, on the on the Facebook page. There's a new song every week that yes, your Facebook page yeah, ne- mm-hmm. yeah, ne- heard. Uh, it's really well produced and mixed because we did it ourselves. <laughs> and um, the yeah, songs Jimmy, in there are that's incredible. A perf- that's a perfect point. Every Monday, everybody, you know, friend yeah. uh, Jimmy Son's Shadows of Night Facebook page. Every Monday, you get it. Every, a- everybody, everybody has a throwback, and of course, I got pictures of <laughs> every kind of thing. Sooner or later, you'll see, sooner or later, I mean, you'll see me beating up Sid Vicious on there. <laughs> I got new, new, new music Mondays, throwback Thursdays, and. Fast Forward Fridays, which always lists where I'm going to be and what's coming up, stuff like that. But well, the uh, New Music Monday is real popular. Uh, Shake is running today, and it's from um, it's from Wolfman Jack. It's a right, live. Yeah. It's got the Wolfman, Wolf, Jack, Wolfman intro, Jack thing. Yeah. yeah, I think it's from '89. Yeah, that's, uh, I believe, yeah, yeah. Now those are those are absolutely live. All those takes, and they're really good. Now, for you know, people talk about original members. Let's touch on that a little bit. Mm-hmm. Original members, and you know, the ones that record and all that. There weren't original members on the Backdoor Man album. There was already two different. On the Shake album, was a whole different band. So, I mean, original members from what? <laughs> original members yeah. from mm-hmm. one album. Now, the guitar player and keyboard player, they're married and they're actually man and woman. <laughs> you never know nowadays. Mm-hmm. They have been with me thirty-five years the ones that are with me now. Oh, so, boy. I mean, to me, they're original members. They've been yeah. with me longer than both my wives and the new one times two plus five. And they've been with me two years longer than that. So, um, and, and they're great in that the, the, the all the live stuff that you see lately, like the, the live shake in and Gloria from Wolfman Jack, that's them. Um, the live, uh, there's, there's, these are real live, uh, really good live Uriah Heap. Uh, of course, I, we all know I got in a little trouble a few years back, and I learned my lesson. I got spanked, and I, I went away for three years. So uh, I have my own version of, I call it dealing. I made my break in a six-year mistake. Dealing when I should have been buying. Uh, but that, that is a, that's a spectacular uh, Uriah Heap. Type, uh, you know, it, it's it's good. Any, and I'll put it against you, live dry heap any day of the week, any day. Mm, mm. It's spectacular players. Uh, that that runs. There, there are ninety YouTubes. There's ninety Jimmy Sound Shadows Night YouTubes. Seventeen oh, oh. of which are seventeen of which are glorious with either Cheap Trick, Rick Springfield, great Gloria player by the way, uh, Ted Nugent. Well, mm-hmm. Steven, you name it, I got a glory with them. Of course, I got to warn you, there's a couple like when you go, you'll, you, you say you'll go to your 
your neighbor's birthday party and you go there and they got, you know, a 15 year old kid playing drums on garbage cans and uh, all you walk in and they start playing glory and hand you a, a microphone. You want to die. There's uh-huh. a few of those. <laughs> <It's>, <laughs> well, hey, listen. It's, but everybody knows the song Gloria, so you're gonna have uh, you know, all, all a, types asking. Uh, to I had I had a I had a 60th birthday party. We could go Saturday at the Blues Bar in Mount Prospect, which is yeah, happy real belated close birthday where, by the way. Yeah, and then that you know we break our attendance record every time we play there. It's right in the middle of where everything started. It's three miles from where the cellar was. It's across the street from the Shadows' first gig ever in 1965 at the VFW Hall. It's right down the street from the high school. I mean, they come out of the woodwork when we play there. I told the guy, I said, I, I, could, I should have given you the door and taken the Walker concession. <laughs> well, I was going to have a new tour. I was going to have a new tour. I was going to call it Gramps with Amps. <laughs> At least they come out, Jimmy, right? <laughs> yeah. 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 Well, yeah. Of course, of course, you got to play early because they're on the second round of the Med by 9 o'clock. Yeah, but. absolutely. Well, maybe that's the best time to play when the Meds kick in. Yeah. <laughs> well, Jimmy, I, I, I want to thank you so much for, for giving us this time. And um, like we alluded to before, yeah, and, it's only a matter of time. Uh, no, I, I, I would like you to stay in the line when we're done here, if you could, for a minute. Because I want to I wanna get the information positively so I can start posting it on the page. Or you'll, you'll pick up some listeners. I, I, I have a, thank God, I have a, still have a wide following of people who like to know what I'm up to. And I would all like right. them all to be able to hear this, too. I appreciate it. I'll say goodbye to you here, but we'll stick on the line after we say goodbye. Okay. But uh, Jimmy, thanks so much for, for giving us and this for time. And for everybody out there, thanks for listening, and keep on rocking. Cause you broke in my heart now Didn't take you too long Our love's on the dark side Now I know you lied Give you all my sweet love But you weren't satisfied Ever since you've been gone Will I love you, honey More than birds love the sky Without your sweet love All I do, baby, is cry You'll be mine Cause I love you forever, girl To the end of time Mine, all mine Please be mine Cause I gotta have you, girl Yeah For nearly a decade, Evan Ginsberg's Legends Radio has featured interviews with the greatest names in the arts and sports Heard worldwide at legendsradio.net, the program has featured these great musical legends, Ray Manzarek of the Doors, Billy Corgan of Smashing Pumpkins, Judy Collins, Roberta Flack, and many more. Stars from movies, TV, and comedy have included Jenny McCarthy, Wayne Brady, 30 Rock's Judah Friedlander, Shelley Berman, Jackie the Joke Man Martling, David Allen Greer, and Paul Mooney. Stars of pro wrestling and MMA include Bruno Sammartino, Rowdy Roddy Piper, superstar Billy Graham, and Frank Shamrock. Co-hosted by renowned journalist Dr. Mike Leno, Legends Radio is heard Wednesdays, 7 p.m. to 9.20 p.m. 
Eastern Standard. We are archived 24-7 with hundreds of hours of classic interviews. Legends Radio also features the best in indie music, showcasing talent deserving wider exposure. I'm from Brooklyn, baby. Don't forget the gravy. We are soldiers! <laughs> You missed the birth of your mother and father. Don't you dare miss Evan Ginsberg's Legends Radio. And not only does Evan have his Legends Radio show, Evan, of course, has his Legends TV show as well. Every Saturday, live, 11 a.m. Eastern Standard Time to 12.30 p.m. Also Eastern Standard Time. That's right. 11 a.m. to 12.30 p.m. Eastern Standard Time every Saturday at LegendsTVNYC.com. That's LegendsTVNYC.com. You can also watch it live at MadhouseTV.com. LegendsTVNYC.com and MadhouseTV.com. And listen to this. You can't get to watch the show live Saturday mornings? No problem. As soon as the show ends, it is archived. Then you just go to MadhouseTV.com and you can watch the show anytime at all. And guess what? I, Steve Ludwig, your humble host on Steve Ludwig's Classic Pop Culture, is Evan's humble co-host on his Legends TV show. That's right. Evan Ginsberg brings his eclectic nature of his radio show to TV, to internet TV, Evan Ginsberg's Legends TV. Go to LegendsTVNYC.com. Go to MadhouseTV.com. Check out the show live every Saturday, 11 a.m. to 12.30 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. And it is archived. So you can watch it right after the initial broadcast, anytime at all, at MadhouseTV.com. See you there, everybody. Evan's humble co-host. Wow! Here we are, season two, and it's your pal, Cookie Puss, from the Carvel Ice Cream Commercials. As I told you last season, Steve Ludwig, my pal, I love Steve, wrote a book about his open heart surgery, quintuple open heart surgery. The book is called See You in CCU, A Lighthearted Tale of My Open Heart Surgery. But it's a funny book. <laughs> that's Steve. What a character. But that's why we love him. You can buy Steve's book at a very special price. Just click on Steve's book right here on Planet Ludwig and you'll see what I mean. Bye from Cookie Puss. I love you. Thank you, Cookmeister General. See you in CCU, a lighthearted tale of my open heart surgery is the name of the book. If you're interested, right here on the website, Steve's book, we have a special season two price for you. Well, everybody, in a few minutes, we're going to be hearing from Mr. Gary D. Henry, author Gary D. Henry. Now, in the opening, I mentioned how prolific he was, but even more than that, he is a great author. We're going to be talking to Gary in a few minutes, but first, right before Gary... We are going to uh, start a new segment, like I mentioned in the opening. My brother Bill will be sharing with us an album cut each week. One of his favorite album cuts from his huge, vast collection of records. So I was thinking, now, what, what theme song could I use to introduce my brother Billy? Uh, of course, I'm going to insert the theme song without him knowing it. Hmm... Which way you going, Billy? Can I go to? Which way you going, Billy? And as I mentioned earlier, this is a real special part of the show here. We're going to start this week. It's going to be a weekly segment with my brother Bill, my slightly older brother Bill. He told me I had to introduce him that way, slightly older. No, but if it wasn't for Bill, like I said before, I wouldn't have had my love for music. He always had all the cool albums, albums most people didn't hear about, as well as all the Beatle albums and everything else. So, each week, Billy's going to give us a little 
album cut, and our first one, I'll let him tell you what it is, and it's my pleasure to introduce my music mentor, my brother Bill. All right, Bill, what do you have for us this first week? Hi, Steve. Uh, the first song I picked for this week was one that uh, has been 40 years in the making, actually.